What's up everyone, Father Winitachi here, you know what it is, and welcome to the first video, the first episode that has actually been recorded for the YouTube channel of youtube.com slash Father Winitachi. So, how this is going to work is this is a new channel, all previous uploads have been re-uploaded from our other channel. Um, welcome to the channel, first of all, and for those of you tuning in, please be sure to subscribe, check out the description box down below, and also check out our other channel, Father Winitachi Plays. So what this channel is all about is it's going to feature all of my soccer and football videos. We're going to be doing challenges, tricks and flicks, uh, different types of training sessions and drills. We're going to be doing actual messing around videos with challenges like this one and so much more. So stay tuned. So without further ado, let's get into the topic of today's video, which you can kind of see behind us. It is going to be based off of Call Out Penalties Halloween Edition. <laughs> this is going to work it is five total attempts you've got the right hand side over there which is going to be the black ghastly figure that is currently hanging and you've got the left hand side with the white ghastly figure that is currently hanging on bottom left and bottom right you currently got some skulls down there that we got to go ahead and hit and of course in the middle you've got little pump aka the pumpkin I'm a smash I don't even know what else to say but how this works is every single time I miss an attempt, I have to take a dip into the Bean Boozled bucket. Now I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a list of the flavors that I'm going to have to hopefully not taste. Starting off with how it works is there's basically two different flavors per color. So you don't know what you're going to get. So first of all, we've got spoiled milk with the bad flavor and good flavor is coconut. You got dead fish as a bad flavor, strawberry banana smoothie as a good flavor. Rotten egg is a bad flavor. Buttered popcorn is a good flavor. Not really great. Toothpaste is a bad flavor. Berry blue is a good flavor. You got barf, which is the one I really don't want to taste, uh, as a bad flavor. And peach is a good flavor. Uh, you've got canned dog food as a bad flavor. And chocolate pudding is a good flavor. That's still not even great. Uh, you got booger as a bad flavor. Juicy pear is a good flavor. Moldy cheese as a bad flavor. Caramel corn as a good flavor. You've also got Stinky Socks as a bad flavor, Tutti Fruity as a good flavor, and last but not least, Lawn Clippings, which is perfect because you guys might be able to hear in the background, we've got perfectly nice cut grass. And last but not least, so Lawn Clippings was bad, with a good one on that is Lime. So without further ado, let's get to our first attempt. So for attempt number one, we are going to be going bottom right, which is the one that I'm most comfortable with, so I should be able to hit it. I'm going to go ahead and use the Bean Boozled Bucket as the penalty spot marker. So without further ado, let's get into attempt number one. There we go. See, attempt number one. I mean, I know it's just passing the ball, but still. Perfect penalty. Let's just make sure that's not broke. Attempt one, clean fam, clean. I can actually take this back home and still use it. So, that is attempt number one completed. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Let's go ahead and, do that. Let's go ahead and hit up number two. We're gonna go ahead and hit bottom left. We're gonna keep the more difficult ones to the end because I really, really don't want to be tasting no bean boozles right now. So, let's get to it. Attempt number two. <laughs> Okay, I already knew I was gonna get bottom left and bottom right first time. Now that I think is broke. So with attempt two done, we actually do got a broken skull. However, give this one a thumbs up. So all you have to do is snap it back into the place and it's good to go. All right, so attempt three, I'm gonna go back to my good side. We're going back to the right, hitting that black ghastly figure on the top right hand side. We gotta smash fam. We've gotta get top bins, so let's get to it. Oh, 
No, we're taking that. We're taking that. Attempt one in the bag. So that is attempts one, two, and three. Bottom right, bottom left, top bins on the top right. Bean boozle. I mean, we're not even going to be taking any today. So now with three of the attempts completed, we've got our third prize here. The ghastly black figure that was in top bins on the upper right hand corner. We're now going to be doing the opposite. His friend, the white ghastly figure that's in the top left hand corner, top bins. I'm, that's the one I'm most afraid of. I, I, I believe I can get the center. That's the one I'm most afraid of. I do not go left ever. Let's just hope I can do it. Listen. Ah, come on, man. I thought that was it. It was a good penalty overall. I doubt a keeper's gonna save that. Oh my god. Sadly, I did not get top left, so that is going to be taking us to the bean boozled bucket, which we're about to do now. That was really close, and to be honest, that looked like a skim, but it wasn't skimmish enough, so I don't take close skimmers. I have to take an actual skimmer. However, I am going to go back home. I'm going to relook at this footage. If it did nick, I will give myself a point. However, right now, I really do feel that didn't hit. So let's go ahead and take a dip into the bean boozled bucket. So how this works, for those of you that don't know, there's plenty of different variations of the Bean Boozled. There's the one that's kind of like a board game where you have a spinner, whatever it lands on, you have to pick one of those colors uh, from the box. This one's actually completely random. Give it a shake, pull up the top, put it down, and you're given a Bean Boozled. Now, this is blue, and the only blue ones are toothpaste and berry blue. So... I'm assuming, I'm assuming this is toothpaste. I should not have smelt that. I'm hoping it tastes like mint and not like used toothpaste. Oh, here we go. It tastes like mint. It actually tastes pretty good. That actually, that, how is that a bad flavor? It's toothpaste, it tastes like mint. You know what? For you guys, I'll do another one. Put this up. Oh, it smells. The bucket smells so bad. That's the thing. There we go. All right. I have to choose one or the other. They're both. Oh, this is so bad. They're both the orange ones. So it's either going to be. It's one or the other. Dead fish is strawberry banana smoothie or barf and peach. I'm going to go ahead and take the new one. The new flavor because I've actually had barf before and I don't like it. I have never had dead fish, so this is either dead fish or strawberry banana smoothie. All right, so here we go. That that smells foul. Oh no! I don't even know what dead fish is. I know what dead fish is, but I don't know what it even tastes or smells like. But this smells bad. Oh. It just smelled bad. It was strawberry banana smoothie. Well then, I'll go for three, fam. If I okay, if I get three, well, I had one bad one, but it was okay, and I had one good one. I'll do three for you guys, and if it's good, we're gonna leave it there because that's not my fault. All right, here we go. Number three. What do we get? We got either canned dog food chocolate pudding or moldy cheese caramel corn. Um, you know what, I'll just take both and hope they're gonna suck no matter what because it's chocolate pudding and canned dog food. Just for you guys, I will take both. Oh, you know what, I'm not even gonna smell it because I already know it's shit. Oh, I, I'll have a drink. Oh my gosh, that is, so, oh my gosh, it is so, I have the worst gag reflexes of all time. I smell anything bad. Oh my gosh, I don't even know what it was. 
It could have been two good things. It was just so bad. I can't get it out of my mouth, fam. All right, so attempt five, going straight down the middle, about to smash a little pump. I really want to figure out what will happen when this hits the pumpkin. Is this going to bounce back and hit me in the face? Or is that going to actually just stay there and I don't even know. Is that, is that at least going to move? That's what I want to know. However, I should have maybe done the bean boozled after because that taste in my mouth is disgusting. But let's get into attempt five. We knocked it off too fast. There we go. Well, as you can see, my pumpkin actually did break. It actually smells pretty good. But my pumpkin did break. It is juicy as, so it is super fresh. As fresh as that last shot. We went four out of five, fam. Alrighty, everyone. So for those of you that tuned in, thank you all very much for tuning in. Much appreciated. Hope you enjoyed the show. Uh, if you can, leave a thumbs up on this video. Shows me that you guys enjoyed it and you guys want to see some more on this channel. Share the video if you can. And of course, subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Again, this is a fresh channel. This is the first actual recording that I did. So we got so much more coming to you guys soon. Uh, if you guys got any suggestions, post down below in the comment section. And again, we got so much more coming soon. So I cannot wait to release some more content on this channel. Ranging from skills challenges to messing around holiday type videos like this one. We've also got compilations coming soon. We've got practices and drills and all so, so much more. So stay tuned for that. Help us grow this channel. And again, check out that description box and help us grow the other channel as well. I ended up finding out I broke both of these skulls. They were on the back. And I don't know if you guys can see this. I really don't want to push it in anymore. But the back of it has cracked. And that happened to both of them. So, I mean, it's still, it's still good. It's still usable. I think the other one's in better condition than this one. And it's kind of sad. I broke everything except the two ghastly figures, which are already broken. But anyways, thank you all very much for tuning in. Catch you guys around.